Today, I will show you two easy methods to create a Polaroid frame for any image. Don't forget to subscribe to never miss more useful tutorials like this one. Make sure you have your desired image in your media pool. Drag a Fusion composition onto your timeline. Open it in Fusion and add a background node. Set the alpha to zero. Add another background and connect it via a merge like so. Feel free to rearrange them if it makes it easier. Change your foreground background to a white color. Add a rectangle mask to your white background and tweak it to a Polaroid shape you like. This is what I got. Grab your image and add it to your node tree like this. Add a transform that we will use later. Use a rectangle mask on the image to get it sized. Once you have it cropped, use the transform node from earlier to move it above the car. Now you are done. Next I will show you an even easier way to create this. For this method, you will take a Polaroid image outline and place it on your timeline. In Fusion, grab your image and attach it like so. Use a transform to size it. Similarly to last time, grab a rectangle and crop it. Make it so your Polaroid outline is the green arrow and the image is the yellow. By switching up your foregrounds and backgrounds, they can basically overlap a bit and you won't notice. Now, add a transform to the outline and scale up that. And also scale up the image to fit the outline. As you can see, the image is now behind and it's easier to make adjustments. Once you have made your final adjustments, you are finished. I try to post tutorials weekly, so feel free to check out the ones on screen. Also, don't forget to subscribe to never miss out on more tutorials like this one.